What's up, party people? Three Pound Nation in the house. Today, we're gonna have some fun. We got storms all around us, and I've got one big tip I'm gonna share with you on this episode. It's gonna be at the end, so you gotta stay the whole time. It's only gonna be about a 10, 12 minute video. Uh, but one big tip that I'm doing right now that's putting a lot of fish in the boat for the guide trips. And uh, I never had to do it this time of year. This is new. And uh, well, stick with me. I'm gonna share it with you. And uh, we're gonna do some active captain. And uh, should be a great day on the water. We've got a lot to do, a lot to talk about. And uh, let's do it. Thanks for watching Three Pound Fishing. Partnered up with these fantastic companies. I'm out here in an evening after a guide trip. I figured why not, I'll go out here, I'll make a little video. And uh, I started thinking about, during, during that guide trip, I was like, you know what? This time of year, I never did that to catch these fish. And that is definitely what has differentiated three pound fishing guide service to everybody else that's on the water. And uh, I used to preach that post-spawn bite was so awesome. And I'll tell you what, it's been harder this year. So a lot of times we go to the, the, the marinas and people are talking about how tough it was. They didn't catch any fish. Uh, they caught one fish. And uh, we're catching, we're still up there in good numbers and it's all because of this. So but we're gonna put some fish in the boat first before I share that top secret with you. Let's do that right here. Black nose, you gotta love it. That is just a solid, beautiful fish. Check that out, folks. It don't get much better than that. Bam! I'm gonna let it go. Go ahead and get the ball started right here, and you're gonna see this bait. Accuracy on cast, very important. Don't forget accuracy on cast. I always tell people, don't sit though at 60 feet out there if you're if you're if you're. Uh, target is only 30 there they are look at this i'm running from them oh baby oh my goodness that was a miss from three pound folks you saw it for your first i never felt it i was just playing the screen to be honest with you i was really just playing the screen and a lot of times i'll do that that should be tip number two here it comes it's gonna be falling in right there accuracy on throw see how accurate that is that's just time on the water you'll get there here we go they should be pretty active. Boom, there it is. Oh my goodness, look at that sucker come up into the water cone. Oh yeah, kicking a little bit. Here we go. Oh yeah, it's a good fish, it's a good fish. That's a good fish. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Fun on the water. Bam, we're letting them go. There it is, we'll let it go. We'll let it go. Some crucial things I like to, to talk about. Braid, number one is braid. Set the hook, that is key, setting the hook. And I'm sorry, but I just, paper, lift, whatever they used to talk about, setting the hook is more important right now, in my opinion. You can react to the screen, the quickness, the feel of it. I love it. All right, there we are, falling in. I hope we still got Active Captain on right here. There they go. I draw it away. I play with them a little bit. Make it a race. Make it a race. Boom, there it is. Oops, they don't get back. Come on, we're just gonna fill up. We just gonna fill up the live well. We're not really gonna fill up the live well. We're giving them back. But either way, that's just fun. That was live. We did, did we even stop the, we didn't even have to edit nothing on that. That's just straight up. I'm gonna do a live feed out here one of these days. Bam, bam. We let that one go. Active captain is off. That's what I'm talking about. So, key things right now. Without a doubt, braid allows me to set the hook on a, such a light bite, a rub, a tick, anything. I'm sorry, I just don't feel like you can do that as well with fluoro and mono. Not that you can't, not that you can't get used to it. I'm just saying, 
and I used to be so against it, but now I am so for it. I'm also for hair jigs. I mean, what can I say? Everything changes as you keep going around the circle of crappie world. Um, it's always amazing how your opinions change. So, cast it right there. Now all the pontoon boats are running from, from the storm. Are you kidding me? No way. Gosh. I'll tell you what, you, you can't keep them on the hook sometimes. I mean, I set the hook pretty darn good on that one. He was on there for a while. I'm, I'm casting today with the 12 footer, three pound fishing elite series. These rods are back in stock at ozarkrod.com. Um, and I'm actually casting with the 12 footer, even though I prefer the 10 footer. 10 footers are down there, but you can do it all with these folks. The right amount of backbone, sensitivity, Everybody that I know that has tried this rod has loved it. Check it out. Try it out. OzarkRod.com. We are searching. Let's see what's new on it. What's new in the world of uh, crappie fishing? Obviously, the Hummingbird, the new Live Mega Live is out. Uh, I'll post my video that I did on Mega Live, which doesn't really show you much, but you certainly are welcome to look at it. Um, but I'll tell you what, it's going to be really interesting to see what those everybody's talking about. Uh, so if you plan on getting Mega Live, let me give me a shout out to, down there. I want to know what your thoughts, why you're wait, you know, what do you think, why you're getting it? Is it because you have all these other Hummingbird electronics and that's why you're doing it? Um, it's going to be really interesting to see whether or not it uh, matches up to uh, Garmin. That's what I'm gonna do. Yeah. Right now I'm throwing one of my hair jigs. If you want to check out my hair jigs, you can go to threepoundfishing.com. But uh, I like to mix it up. Uh, you know, some days a hair jig works better than a paddle tail and vice versa. You know, you just don't know. You just gotta keep throwing stuff at them. And apparently nothing works there, so we're gonna change it up. Oh, ho, 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 ho. that was a fun. Maybe not the biggest fish. It's a good fish, though. But that was fun. I'll tell you exactly how I did that. Another great little, you gotta play with these fish when they're a little finicky. And what this fish was doing, it was coming at me really hard. So what I did was I slowed down just right before, and I, I never felt the bite. That's a heavy fish. I never felt the bite, and um, I just set the hook. I mean, literally, I'm, I, I sped it up, that, and that made him hungry, so he's following really hard, and then I slowed it down, and it's almost like he, and boom, set the hook. Key word right there, folks. Key word, set the hook. All right, here we go. This is with 10 footer. I like the 10 footer. 10 footer is, you know, if I'm gonna cast, I can do it all with my 10 footer. I like them all, I can do it with the 12, but at the end of the day, that is my preference is the 10 footer. Baby, that's a good fish. Gosh dang, that's heavy. Still got a lot of hats available on the website. Check them out, 3poundfishing.com. Uh, tackle store has started up. It's looking good. If you're into hair jigs, which I am completely now, um, you can check those out as well. But the hats, the lids, 3 pound fishing lids are awesome, man. Um, always appreciate people to buy those a lot of people on the guide trips buy them if you come on a guide trip just so you know you did get, you get a discount on a hat you get a discount on, um, on jigs the guide trips are going awesome right now um, we've got a storm brewing around us we've had storms all day here and there but right now we've got one that's kind of sneaking up on us but um 
Guide trips are going awesome. And uh, I'm booking into, uh, well, this summer, give me a holler, give me a text message. You can get a hold of me at freetimefishing at gmail.com. Bam! There it is. Look at this. How many do I got there? Eh, you know, you're thinking, what, eight? So fish? The secret, folks, is this. Cast to them. That's it. That's what's been making the biggest difference between what we're doing and what other people are doing is people are getting up on the fish too early on this tough bite in Southern Illinois. You need to cast to them. And I'm telling you, I cast to them, folks, 30 feet every time. I never go up on them until I absolutely have to. And and that even re even regards to like just pitching it, uh, it's just the cast. That is that is the biggest secret in the world. It takes a while to get accurate with it, but at the end of the day, when you do, it's so valuable to be able to stay back and uh, and get these fish this way. Now look at this guy coming right now. You should have that on active. Right. Look at this guy coming right at it. There he is. Never felt it. Playing the screen, and this is a good fish. Hogged, and he just got off there. Unbelievable. We, he, he took the bait. Good night. That was a good fish. That's it, folks. That's fun. That's fun time. Thanks for joining me. Three pound fishing, baby. We're going to call it three pound fishing nation. I kind of like that. You know? Either way, we appreciate you. We appreciate your support. Have you subscribed yet? Hit that notification bell. My gosh, hit that notification bell. Putting out all this content, you should. Thanks for watching 3 Pound Fishing, partnered up with these fantastic companies.